What's up everyone, it's Python Handler from Focusus and I'm back with a full mini project using Python. In this video, we'll be creating a text editor from scratch. Here, I'm gonna be using Visual Studio Code to complete this project, but you can also use other editors as well. The concept we are gonna be using in this project is called GUI or Graphical User Interface. In our text editor, we are gonna have file option and inside it, we are gonna have new file, open file, save, save as and exit as menus. In Python, for GUI, we have a module called tkinter. So to import it, we type from tkinter import asterisk. So asterisk allows you to import all the basic functions of the tkinter package. And in order to open file dialog, while opening or saving a file, we have to import a function called file dialog. So for that we type from tkinter import file dialog. And now we create a function for new file option. So for that we type define new file and a function close. So when we click on new file, we want our program to remove all the contents of the text editor. So for that we type text.delete 0, 0.0 comma end here first 0 stands for first row of the text editor and second 0 stands for first column of the text editor this line deletes the contents of the text editor from the first row and first column up to the end so now we are gonna create a function for open file option so for that we type define open file and function closed now in order to open file dialog while opening a file we have a function called ask open file so for that we create a variable file one and we type file dialog dot ask open file and its mode is equal to r here r stands for read so now to read the contents of the file one file, we create a variable data and type file one dot read. So now in order to delete the contents of the text editor, we type text dot delete 0, 0.0 comma end. And at last to display the contents of the data variable, we type text dot insert 0, 0.0 comma data so now we are gonna create a function for a save file so we type define save file and function closed so when we click on save file the file must be saved with a default file name so let the file name be untitled.txt and now to get the contents of the text editor, we create a variable data and type text.get 0.0 comma end. And now to create untitled.txt file, we create a variable file one and type open file name comma w here w stands for write and at last to store the contents of the data variable in file on file we type file one dot write data so now we are gonna create a function for a save as option so we type define save as and function closed so now to open save as file dialog when we click on save as we have a function called ask save as file so for that we type file one is called to file dialog dot ask save as file and its mode is called to w which stands for write so now to get the contents of the text editor we type data is called to text dot get 0, 0.0 comma end and now to store the contents of the data variable in file one file we type file1.write and data 
so these are all the functions that we are going to require in this program so now to open a tk enter window we need to create a tk enter object and store it in a variable so let the variable be gui and we type tk so to give it a title we type gui dot title text editor to give our window a geometry or to assign it certain length and breadth we type gui dot geometry and 600 x 500 here 600 is the length and 500 is the breadth so for our program to give us an area to type something we type text which is a variable this time and again text this time the t should be capital and gui which is the name of our tick enter object so now to display the text we type text dot pack so to create a file option and inside it to create multiple menus we need to assign menu function to two variables so for for that we type my menu is called to menu which is the first menu variable and another be list one and inside it also we type menu so to create a new file option we have a function called add command and we use it by typing list one dot add command inside the parameter we type label is called to new file and its command is the new file function so we type new file we are gonna do the same for all our functions too so i'm gonna copy this and i'm gonna paste this and here i'm gonna type open file and its command is open file here i'm gonna type save and its command is save file here i'm gonna type save as and the command is save as function also we need to have exit option in our file menu so for that we type labels called to exit and command is called to gui dot quit so to create a file option in our program we have a function called add cascade and we need to use it in my menu variable so we type my menu dot add cascade and its labels called to file and its menu is list one so to make this work we type gui dot config menu is called to my menu and at last to display the window in our screen we type gui dot main loop so now i'm gonna run this program so now we get a tk intro window so now i'm gonna type something this is my first text editor I'm gonna copy this now and now when I click on new file we can see that it gets deleted I'm gonna paste it again so now when I save it this gets saved so now when I go to open file and I click on API we get this line so this is exactly the same line we have in the API file So now I'm gonna erase this and I'm gonna paste this and now I'm gonna save it by using save as and I'm gonna save it in text folder and I'm gonna give it name hello.txt 
txt and when i go to the folder now and i click on hello i get this and now finally when i click on exit the window gets closed so this is how you make a text editor using python so if you want to get this code i have uploaded it in my github account you can access it by clicking the link in the description below thank you and stay tuned for more exciting projects